Hey guys, welcome back. Today's video is going to be a what's in my bag video. I think the last one I did was in the spring. I like to do these two to three times a year, so we're definitely due for another one. I love filming these videos and I love watching them as well because us women, you never know what's going to be inside our damn handbags. But anyways, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, hit the like button, and the notification bell down below. And without further ado, if you guys would like to see what's inside my bag, then just keep watching. Well, first off, I just wanted to quickly mention my handbag. You guys have probably seen this in many of my videos. This is the handbag pretty much that I use year-round. It is a Louis Vuitton never full mm and it is in the damier of being a ben i never know how to say that correctly but that's the print that it's in i love this and you guys i've had this bag for i want to say four years it's such a great bag to own i mean if anything gets on it you can wipe it off and it just almost looks honestly brand new. I can fit anything in it. I could throw it in, take it out. It doesn't really have too many compartments, which is great. So I can fit a lot of crap inside there. But anyways, I just wanted to mention the bag that I have. So I guess I'll start with my wallet first. Now, I've mentioned this wallet before. I know it looks like it's a little bit off in color, but in person it really doesn't look like it. But this is from Amazon, this wallet right here. I believe it's like the brand Daisy Rose or whatever, but they can get away with selling these because they don't say Louis Vuitton in the checkers. So I didn't want to spend like hundreds of dollars on a wallet to match this that nobody's really going to see. So I just got this one. So that is the wallet that I'm using. I love it. I've had it for a while and the quality of it's really good. I can fit a lot in it. So I like never have, it's like bad. First off, I always leave my wallet open like this. I never close it. I know that's probably a bad habit. But um, I actually have cash, which is crazy because I think in any of these videos I filmed, I've never had cash on me. I, I don't even use cash for anything. I always have a card. But um, I just have, like, you know, random crap in here. I have a free car wash, um, just a lot of different, like, cards. As you guys can see, I had some change in there as well. So that is my wallet. Next, just some random odds and ends, phone charger, headphones, all tangled up. That is definitely the story of my life. I never like take the time to like untangle them. I just throw them in my purse, take them out. So this gum has been in a couple of my videos, you guys. This is my favorite gum. I have my whole family hooked on it. I think they still are hooked on it. But um, it is the Orbit Bubble Mint Gum. And it, this is like, it comes with like 55 pieces. I mentioned in my last video, I could go through one of these in a week. I have definitely gotten a lot better. One of these can last me two to three weeks now, which is good. I was weighing, I was chewing way too much gum before, but this gum is so amazing, you guys. It's so delicious I love it so I always have this inside my purse and if you guys haven't tried this gum definitely should it's amazing next are my heavy ass keys which I never really take out of my purse unless I'm going to the gym which is planet fitness I have my little keychain right there but um I've got our SUV right here and then I've got my car right here but I never use it because obviously I don't need my keys to start my car and then I have my sunglasses I have the same exact pair inside my car but I like to keep a pair inside my purse but I really should get a case for these I've mentioned these before they're Jessica Simpson and I feel like they still carry these at um Marshalls or TJ Maxx. I don't know which one I got them at, but I love these sunglasses, you guys. I love oversized sunglasses, and they're kind of like that tortoise um, gradient effect. I really love it. These were ten dollars. I don't spend, um, you know, I used to spend hundreds of dollars on sunglasses. I don't do it anymore because they get scratched up so quickly. So ten dollar sunglasses will do for me. I love these, and I have, like I said, a backup in my car. And I have seen these, so they do have them still. Here and there but these are my favorite ones so I like to keep these inside my purse so now is this little kind of like makeup bag I keep in my purse but honestly you guys I really don't go into this I really don't even like use makeup on the go um, I just kind of keep stuff in here just in case of an emergency per se this is an ipsy bag I got a while ago it's like a bigger one I'll probably like switch it out soon but it fits quite a bit so I've got like my doll in here all the essentials I've got um, a tie to go stick these are amazing they come in handy so much and I swear every time I wear white and I'm drinking coffee something happens whether it's white pants a white shirt so these tie sticks honestly you guys are great they really do get the stains out. I would highly recommend these. So I always have one of these with me. 
I've got eye drops, I've got a mirror, I've got a brush, actually it was attached to this, but like they kind of like broke off. I've got tampons, a little TMI, but hey. Um, I've got some pens in here. I've got this Juicy Tubes Lancome lip gloss. I've got quite a bit of lip glosses in here, as you guys will see. Um, this doesn't have a cap on it. i got to find the cap, but this is just a smaller hand cream. It's Bath & Body Works um, Comfort um, Hand Lotion. It's really nice. It smells amazing. I just have to find the cap to that. Um, what else do I have in here? Oh, I have, I think this is like leftover from the last video, but hey, you never know. Especially with my husband, I carry the Pepto-Bismol to go, you know, because again, especially with him, you never know when he's going to need it. So that's like pretty much in a nutshell what I carry in here. I have tweezers. Um, I might have like a concealer in here. I'm not sure. I don't even know why I have a lip liner in here because I don't even like really use lip liner. I think I did have a mascara in here, but it dried up. So yeah, I just have like odds and ends in here. So next, I totally forgot that I had these in here and they're kind of like ripped up per se, but... They are Burger King coupons. My husband loves Burger King, and I do too, but he eats it way more than I do. So I'll be out, like, you know, running errands, picking up something, grocery shopping, whatever, and he'll be like, can you get me Burger King? So I get these coupons in the mail, so I just stick them in my purse um, whenever he calls me, so I have them because there's some really good deals on here. Um, I used one of them, and then it's funny because, like, the other day, I was like, I called my husband, I'm like, um, Burger King keeps sending us coupons, and he's like, they must know we go here, but, um, I think there was, like, a family, um, the lady, when I was giving her this coupon, yeah, it's like a $12.99 family bundle, three Whopper sandwiches, three cheeseburgers, and three small french fries, that's, like, a pretty good deal, and I think me and my husband, because we've been seeing the commercials for it, I know this is, like, not good, but we still want to try it, that, like, pretzel burger looks delicious, so, yes, I have some Burger King coupons in my purse, I always I always have some type of antibacterial hand gel in my purse, so right now, since it is fall, I have the Champagne and Apple Honey from Bath & Body Works. This smells really nice, and I've actually been using quite a bit of it. It's like halfway finished. I have a couple other ones, so this is the one that I have. And then it looks like I have a doctor's appointment on October 28th at 10.30. I've actually got to um, write this down in my like little planner, and then I can just throw that card away. And then I have some like lip products in here if I can get them. I don't know if I have like two or three. I'm kind of like feeling around in here. So I have, it looks like MAC Faux. I keep it in my purse because this is just like my favorite everyday nude color I can wear anywhere. It's really pretty. I've probably mentioned it in a million videos so I think I have one in there and then I just like to keep one in my purse and then this lip gloss I use all the time it's pure and I don't know like what um it is in the shade focus but it's just a really it's got a little bit of color into it it's not clear I like a little bit of color in my lip glosses so for days that I don't want to wear a lipstick at least I have like a little bit of color on my lips but this one's really nice and then next I actually just got this I got this off Amazon I wanted to get something to kind of track my steps track my calories that I could use in conjunction with my phone um, with like an app so I got this off Amazon it's like a little like fitness watch and you can kind of like set it has like different settings on it but it basically um, I'm at zero right now because I haven't put it on today and you probably can't see it but um it um, tracks your steps your heart rate everything like that so I keep it in my purse for when I go to the gym and I actually should like take it out because I want to see how many steps I just do around the house um, you know per day but it's crazy you guys because the first time I did get this I had it on a whole day and I didn't even realize how many steps I do it you don't realize it and at first I'm like is this accurate because it was saying I did like thousands of steps but I guess you just really don't realize it because it's not like you're counting your steps everywhere you go all day long so um, it's really nice to have these it's really interesting because I didn't really um, know how many steps I took and if I can find my phone I don't know where it is but um this you download an app and it basically you put all your information in and you got to set up your stride um, you know your strides for you know how far apart it, your legs are when you walk that's important because that affects the accuracy of it you kind of like set that up you put your weight your height and all that and there's other different features on that 
app as well that are great. So um, I wanted to get a cheap one because Fitbits are like anywhere from like a hundred plus dollars. This one I believe is under 30 at Amazon. So I really like it. I got the pink, of course. My husband has the black. My husband, it's like crazy. He did like, because he works for UPS and he did, I don't even know, like over 20,000, maybe 30,000 steps in a day. It's like crazy. So um, your steps add up. So we've been liking these and you know, they're, they're super affordable. I think they have like a nice like purple color and then some other colors too. And then the way you kind of like charge it is you you know just charge it by like USB like that so um, this is why it's in my purse I like to use it when I'm at the gym but I'm actually gonna keep it out and maybe like put it on for the rest of the day just to track my steps If you guys are interested in this I will link it down below again this is a pretty good one and it's affordable and it's from Amazon it's crazy because I feel like I don't have as much in my purse as I normally do so this is like it's kind of embarrassing but I kind of just like have all my passwords written down because as you guys know, like say you have a go-to password, well on other sites it won't be, you, you won't be able to use it because it's got to have a capital letter, it's got to have um, some kind of symbol, it's got to be eight letters long, it's got to be this, it's got to be that, and then it comes to a point where I've created so many different passwords that I don't freaking remember them. So I have them written down in here um, in my purse. I don't even know why it ended up in my purse. I think I needed it one day. So I just have all my passwords written down. I should probably just put them all in my phone. That would make more sense. But it's like so annoying with those damn passwords setting them up, you guys. And then I forget them. And then like you got to, you know, go to your email, set up a new one. And how many times have you created a password and it tells you it's not good enough? Your password's not good enough. So that's why I write them down, you guys. And then last Lastly, but not least, I just have medication. That's all. I just have my medication in here. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it, you guys. I'm super impressed that I don't have a lot of items in here. Um, again, these Burger King coupons are probably one of my favorite things in here. Yes, their fries are me and my husband's favorite when you compare them to like McDonald's or Wendy's. We think that Burger King definitely um, takes the prize for fries. What do you guys think as I'm like putting stuff back in my purse? What do you guys think if you guys eat fast food? I don't eat fast food all the time, and honestly, like, I wouldn't eat fast food if it wasn't for my husband. My husband can eat anything and not gain a damn pound, but um, in terms of, like, fast food, if you, you know, get it occasionally, what is your guys' preference? Do you like Burger King? Do you like McDonald's? Do you like Wendy's? And, you know, whose fries do you like the best? That's a question I'd be curious to find out. Let me know in the comments down below, do you have a very organized purse or does your purse kind of like have just everything stuffed into it? I try to be uh, like meticulous almost. I start off being like, oh, I'm going to keep my purse super organized, and then it just kind of goes downhill. Same with my wallet. I'm like, oh, I'm going to keep my wallet super organized, and then I just stuff everything into it. So what do you guys do? Do you guys have an organized purse? Are you good at keeping it organized, or are you just like throwing stuff in like this? I'd be curious to find out what is inside your guys' purse. But anyways, that is it for this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I hope you have a wonderful week, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.